Okay, so we just stopped in Nicolosi and just mm. bought Arancini. Arancino. Arancino? Arancino? One is Arancino, Plura is Arancino. Oh, Sorry, there you go. Mm. That's all right. Just bought it from uh, Dolce Vita Cafe and we're on our way up to Etna. So wow, these are okay. just cost us two euros. <laughs> to the base of Mount Etna and then we're going to go up those little cable cars I'm not sure if you can see them just in front of us that take us up to 2,500 meters you can do walks all around the place you can hire stuff there's quad bikes there's mountain bikes as you can see there's quite a bit of snow up here as well so it's pretty chilly you have cafes and bars but up there is where it's happening <laughs> So, we're getting on the cable car now to go up over Mount Etna. Woohoo! That's what it looks like, little, little ticket. He's waiting. Wait for it to come round. And then we're going up there. That's it, here we go. Some little snowmobiles. You right there, my love? <laughs> Look, yeah. I'm going up over it now. <laughs> Let's just turn this around and have a little look. Bye. Oh, There's so much snow as I thought there would actually be. Oh, good, someone's left their sledge on the side. Oh, good. Yeah, don't worry. Oh, There's even more snow over there, look. Oh, yes, yeah, so there is. Now we're looking for a bit of. Uh, I want to see some major lava action. action. There's supposed to be some little cheeky little eruptions somewhere today. Oh my god, oh, this is so cool. Very good. It's quite a desolate looking landscape, isn't it? I think it's, everything's probably dusty from all the eruptions they've had. Still going up. So we're now up the cable car. This is what they use for clearing all the snow by the looks of it. Obviously, looks like they get quite a lot because that's pretty serious. And that's the off-road buses there. So you can get those, they'll take you up uh, further, I think another 500 meters. They're quite expensive. So we're going to do a little walk-in tour instead. You can now see, so this is two and a half thousand feet, uh, sorry, two and a half thousand meters above sea level. Also, we're above the cloud line. So this is having to wander around. There's loads of I'm not sure, we're not sure if that's steam. It looks like we see some steam in the distance. If you look just above and this here, <laughs> just above, it looks like there's steam. It's not, yeah, it's not on the cloud. Okay. So it's like the cloud suddenly turning. Is it, is it burning? cold up here. You can't really see it at the moment but the the ground is actually steaming. That snow is melting. This is so cool. Oh, I just want to see some lava. <laughs> 
go. Getting higher now, look. The ground is steaming. How dark it is up there, isn't it? It's snowing now, but only a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. It's quite eerie. That's <laughs> <laughs> so cool. So <laughs> like quite a bit, a 4x4 higher. Take you all the way up. Yeah. Okay. So this is where the buses come, 4x4 buses. And we're just going to walk out a little bit. The uh, bit of cloud has come in, so it's getting a bit chillier now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah look at this. Look at that. It's all the ash that's settled on top of the ice. That, and considering that I'm about six foot, and that snow is taller than me. <gasps> It's getting a bit heavier snow. It's not really settling because the ground is actually quite warm. There's only a certain point that you can go up here. I'm not sure if that's the sign, but no, uh, surely it'll be a sign that we can actually read. Yeah. This you found online that you can't walk all the way to your top on your own, obviously, because if you're inexperienced, then you'll probably get lost or die. So uh, you need to go by a guide. And you just follow the road. There's these poles on the side of the road. You just follow them as far as you want to go. We've been walking now for about I don't know, half an hour. I guess so. Yeah. And you can see how snowy it is. As we've started to walk further up, the snow has disappeared. Now it's all just sort of volcanic ash, I guess, now, is it? Yeah, it's like stones. But it's really strange because the ground is, you know, it's not cold, it's, uh, but it's still snowing. But nothing settling up there. Nothing settling at all. Still going. Can you see it at the yeah. top? Okay, so we're back at the, uh, the level where the cable car will take us down the mountain. You can see from the visibility now how much it's changed since we left. Can't see a thing now, look. Where that guy is disappearing into the mist. That's where we went. That's it, we just need to get the cable car back down. That's the end of our Etna trip. Just need to get the, uh, the bus there that'll take us all the way back into Catania. Oh, I'm going. That's it. In you go. In you go. There we go. All right, right. Don't look at me now. Because I'm just taking my hat off. My hair is everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're off. Woo! Victory! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> That's it. Down we go. Brilliant. Oh. So you can walk up here if you want to on that road. You don't want to do that. Get a cable car. <laughs> <laughs>